Hello, I'm Miss Horrorfest 2007 for Avenger Dark Films at horrorfestonline.com. You're watching Real TV Films. And I'm here with Real TV Films and Miss Horror Fest 2. How are you today? I'm doing really good. How are you? <laughs> I'm, I'm great. Now that you're standing next to me, you're definitely the hottest interview I've had all day. Okay. And uh, I can see why they elected you to be Miss Horror Fest 2. Tell me a little bit about what you had to do to become Miss Horror Fest 2. Um, well, every year After Dark Films chooses a new spokes model, and it's the most watched YouTube contest in YouTube history. And they post all these webisodes. Uh, everyone goes on and votes for who they want to win. And you win money, and you get to win uh, a year of being the spokes model and going around to conventions and representing After Dark Films, the eight films to die for, and the horrorfestonline.com. Wow. Now, how has your year been? How far into your year are you? Well, um, my year, sadly, is going to be up uh, at the end of December. They choose a different model every year, and I'm really sad about that, but it's been a great run, and I highly recommend, if you're interested in becoming Miss Horror Fest, definitely, definitely check it out. You have until October 17th, actually, to get a video submission in, so you should go to uh, the Horror Fest online and check it out. So how many girls did you have to run against to get to, to win? Well, we had eight semifinalists, and then they narrowed it down to four semi, uh, four finalists, and then everyone voted for who they wanted to win. As far as uh, submissions across the United States goes, I honestly can't give you a good answer because there was a lot, and that's that's all I can say is there's a lot because I really have no idea. Well, I can see why you won. Uh, now, tell me a little bit about what you're wearing because we couldn't be any more opposite, right? And I'd kind of like to be in what you're wearing. Um, well... We, I know that they're auctioning this off. It's one of David E. Kelly's um, costumes that he's designed. So I'm guessing it's a Catwoman, and I picked it off the rack. Um, I was cold, so I wanted something with coverage, and it just happened to fit me good. So, and it's leather. So I thought, this is hot. I, I can wear it around, and it's, it's uh, costumey for Halloween. So that's what we're doing. So I'm very sexy. Thank you. <laughs> so uh, what can we look to see for, uh, from you in the future? Um, well, hopefully uh, I can continue being in entertainment industry, but um, as far as After Dark goes, we've got uh, another eight films that we're choosing. Those will be out January 9th through the 15th. We're actually uh, in the process of choosing a new Miss Horror Fest, so you can go to youtube.com slash horror fest to check out all the webisodes. You can go online and vote for who you think could be the best spokesperson for After Dark for next year. And um, that's pretty much it. You can check out the films at horrorfestonline.com and see what we've going on. It's going to be really exciting here. Well, I'm excited for you. It was really nice to meet you nice today. To meet. Thank you for chatting with me. No problem. I'm Lauren McDonald from Real TV Films. Deep inside the monster pit, heart so blue and hearts that